Mechanic is just killing it out there. The market acceptance has been great, but don't buy a holster for your Canik until you watch this video. We've worked for months on holsters for Canik pistols, and I'm so happy to tell you that we have holsters that fit your Canik pistol perfectly. However, we've also noticed in this process that these pistols are different. Some are different in the trigger guard, some are different in the overall height. As a result, we're announcing support for almost all the Canik pistols. So first off, we have a no light configuration for the MC9. Now this is a super popular micro compact pistol and we have inside the waistband support, both left as well as a right-handed holster. And of course, this holster supports a slide mounted optic or it supports threaded barrel drop through. Also comes with a claw that helps rotate the pistol into your body for more concealability. Comes with our multi-position belt clip. We've got our accessory holes so that you can run other accessories such as DCC metal clips. And of course, we've got adjustable retention. This is the M6 inside the waistband for the Canik MC9 with the TL R7 sub. This is a popular combination with a great light. Nice light and pistol combination right there. Most of you are either running the regular TP9 or the Mete, and we have a holster specific for this. This is a holster that's cut for the regular TP9 and Mete length, and it is a perfect fit for those pistols. Now the subcompact does not fit in this regular TP9 holster. It has just got a trigger guard that's a little bit too short to catch the retention point. Now, finally, I know a lot of you people are running the Rival and the Rival S, and they did some nice things with this, but they also made the distance between the top of the slide and the light rail a little bit taller, so it will not properly fit into your regular TP9 holster you can see it's actually pushing that pistol out of battery. So we brought you a Rival holster that fits perfectly with that Rival and Rival S, and it's also cut to that length. There's the Rival S with the aptly named Balder S. Let's uh, go ahead and put on our outside the waistband. So this holster's definitely built a little bit more for the range. I think most of you are gonna be carrying that outside the waistband and it'll just be for range time or potentially duty time, although I don't know what duty use most Canik pistols are put to in the US. Feel secure. Of course, with that heavy rival S, this is a peach to shoot. So in summary, the MC9 requires its own holster, the Rivals require their own holsters, the TP9 and Mete usually fit in their sp specific holster. The only pistol that we don't have a holster solution for today in August is this subcompact with that shorter trigger guard. So if you're looking for a holster for your Canik, how do you know which holster to get? Well, go to works.com, click on our holster finder, which is on the main page, select your exact Canik pistol, and we will lead you to the right solutions that we have available for you. So here at Works, we design and build precision fit holsters for pistols with lights, because you deserve to defend those you love day or night. Now, we have already released the uh, MC9 with the TLR7 sub combination. In addition, today I want to announce that we've got support for the super popular Olight Balder S, and that works with just about any of the pistols that we've talked about here. Now I'm gonna try mounting this up on the subcompact version, and it does fit reasonably well. It, we do get a tiny, tiny bit of interference with your mag catch, so if you choose to run the SC with the Olight Balder S, we are not going to advertise that this holster fits it properly because we've got that tad bit of interference. So of course, since I talk about the Balder S, you might be wondering, well, what about the Balder Mini? Well, here is the Mini. You may notice that I've got the Mini attached in the rail about a middle position. If I go ahead and I move this forward or backwards, 
versus that middle position, I'm actually gonna have it not fit properly in the holster. So this fits up super well. There is a tiny bit of movement here. I think for most people, you're gonna find that acceptable. Now, one of the other things we do for our Olight holsters is we have an extra channel down below for charging pendant support. Now, if I have this on my nightstand, I can have this on a charger and I can just grab my holster and pull away. Alternately, if I just need to draw my pistol, I can do that unimpeded. It's August 2023 and we're working hard to get a full line of light bearing holsters for these Canics. So if you're looking for a holster for your Canic and you want a precision fit, please go to works.com, go to the holster finder, look for your Canic pistol and your light combination and make sure that you've got the exact model of each and see if we've got a solution for you. In addition to our holsters precision fit for Canic pistols, we also have a line of holsters that are built around the light. These would be holsters that are working for the X300 and the TLR1 and some of the larger O-lights. So if we don't have a precision fit holster for your Canic, we may still have a solution for you with our outlier holsters.